ICC prosecutor Fatou Ben Soda came to Brussels to update the European Parliament's Human Rights Committee about the progress of her cases. Her office has opened an investigation against the South African government for not handing over Sudanese President Omar al-Bashir when he attended an AU summit in Johannesburg in June. It's fanned the flames of anti-ICC sentiment. The denial of justice for the victims of these crimes is, is, is what is uh, important here. And the longer we do not uh, um, have President Bashir surrendered to the ICC, the longer the victims of these crimes will wait to, f to see that justice is, is done. How does it make you feel when people call you a traitor to the African continent? Yeah. I mean, it doesn't bother me because I'm not. I'm not a traitor. Um, there are people who are interested in saying that because of, as I told you, the propaganda. Uh, they do not want the work of the ICC to be done or to be done fairly. They want me to, be favor, uh, to favor some people and not. And when I took this office, I said I was going to do my work without fear or favor. Many European politicians here at the Parliament believe South Africa should have handed over President al-Bashir. We have evidence that are completely clear. There is no doubt about the responsibility in Darfur and the victims in Darfur are still waiting. While the investigation of non-compliance against South Africa continues, the prosecutor insists what's crucial in this case is to get Sudanese President Omar al-Bashir into ICC custody so he can face the charges against him. Jack Parrick, SABC News, Brussels.